Hi there! What the steps for uninstalling Windows 7 from a multi-boot system by formatting or deleting an existing partition on your PC? Well, I'm here to help you do just that. At iYogi, we try to help computer users get answers to their tech queries. You should know that if you are running a multi-boot system with Windows 7 installed on a computer that is also running an earlier version of Windows, such as Windows Vista, you might be able to safely remove Windows 7 from the computer depending on how the computer is set up. Also, don't format or delete the earlier version of Windows in a multi-boot configuration as doing so could make your computer inoperable. So, here's how you can uninstall Windows 7 from a multi-boot system by formatting or deleting an existing partition. Follow me. Click on the Start button. Go to the Control Panel. Click on System and Security. Click on Administrative Tools and then double-click on Computer Management. In the left pane under Storage, click Disk Management. Right-click the volume that Windows 7 is installed on and then click Format to format the partition or click Delete Volume to delete the partition. Click Yes to confirm. So, you see, with the help of the steps shown in this video, you can uninstall Windows 7 from a multi-boot system by formatting or deleting an existing partition on your computer with complete ease. Don't you just love technology? At iYogi, we're always here to help you get more out of your PC along with its related software and programs. If you have questions on antivirus, security, protection, or on how to work your other devices with your PC, such as syncing your printer, MP3 player, camera, or router, etc., just give us a call. We'd be delighted to help. Go ahead, have fun with your PC. Good karma.